For our next interview, we visited Stockport, where Master Chen Dei Ching runs one of his wuxia classes. Master Chen was kind enough to give us a lengthy interview about what he considers is the state of wuxia in Britain and the state of wuxia in general. This, you, 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 you trained when um, wuxia was changing a lot in the 90s. Yeah. And like nowadays there's lots of difficulty techniques. Yeah. Uh, what, what do you think that the 90s focused on? Which, which, uh, which part of wuxia do you think the 90s? Right. Um, for myself, in terms of myself, I do prefer traditional wushu mm -hmm. and something around the 1990 uh, in those years. Mm -hmm. uh, wushu still contains uh, good uh, fighting skills yeah. and uh, body language. Uh, people still do jump, but uh, not as focused mm -hmm. as now. Um, what do you mean by focus? You mean uh, because nowadays you, know, you see like uh, wushu, especially like uh, professional wushu athletes, they concentrate on lots of jumps mm. and uh, how to twist more, how to jump higher. Mm. Um, in some way, I don't. I understand the points. You know, um, in let's say. Wushu, like Chinese government, had been making hard effort mm -hmm. for Wushu to enter Olympic Games. Yeah. To, you know, for people to practice this worldwide, mm -hmm. is uh, not an easy job. So let's think like gymnastics. They yeah. give like certain difficulty to to do to for people to practice to compete on. Maybe that's easy or fair for everyone who practice no matter where in the world. So you're saying in China it's very standardized, so that it's mm -hmm. so it can become a uh, sport like of competition. Right. I think or I believe mm. wushu is divided in, into different ways now. Mm. Yeah. Uh, some way, let's say fancy wushu or fancy martial arts or like another word it may be sport wushu yeah. sport martial arts that means people compete just uh, beautifully mm. who could jump high mm. you know who could twist more for points rather than for effectiveness in yeah fighting. yeah in that way lost in my opinion lost the initial purpose mm. of Kung Fu or initial purpose of Wu Shu. The most principal question we asked all our interviewees in this documentary is, what does Wushu mean to them? On a more personal level, as well as their overall view. <clears throat> it means the world to me. I mean, not only from the cultural side, but for competing. It's what I, you know, it's what we live, eat, dream, and you know, it's what we want to do. I mean, I've been training you know, since I was really young, and it's always what I've wanted to do. And it's, you know, it's, it's really important to me. If I lose, if I lose that, then you know. It's not. It's something that you can't replace in your life. It's it's a sport in its own. It's, it's like it's like a religion almost. My passion for wushu is probably the same as that of um, a die-hard football fan, do you know what I mean? Um, there isn't a day goes by when I don't think or train in wushu um, because it, to me it is everything that I do, I mean you do it for so long uh, that it just becomes a part of your life and it's just there, you know, you can't take it away, you know, you, you, 
don't train for a day and you get frustrated because you haven't trained for a day. Um, it's really, really important to me. It's you know one of the one of the most important things in my life. I would say next to my car. Oh, and my girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, I get that one in. But um, yeah, I would say it's extremely important. Wushu is a great sport to be involved in. It's very exciting. There is a lot of uh, there's a lot of versatility. You can specialise in Taiji, Changchun. You know, you know th th there's always something for you to do. Even at, if you're not doing a competitive level, you know, it's still very good sport for physical fitness, and uh, more so than, than most sports. It's great for physical fitness. So you know, it's it's good for you know youngsters, older people to, to get involved. But there's always something for everyone. Wushu means to me, one is uh, something like uh, helpful in my life. And uh, Wushu, on the other hand, to me, I think is a skill. Uh, I think there is uh, something very deeply to understand, or hard to understand in terms of Chinese uh, Wushu. There are lots of different uh, styles too. So, Simply Wushu means to me is really not a yeah I since I used to you know serve as a professional athlete I do believe Wushu I wanted to play it as elegant as beautiful as I can but I hope everything I do I understand I understand what's really inside in terms of self defense not only play play like elegant and also play the real.